Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh I'm Dias Anggweni I'm going to tell you a story entitled Roro Jongrang Once upon a time there were two Hindu kingdoms Penging and Kraton Boko Penging kingdom was led by a king named Prabu Damarmoyo who had a son named Bandung Manawasa. Meanwhile, Kraton Boko was led by a cruel and easily angry king named Prabu Boko. Prabu Boko had a very beautiful daughter named Rara Jongram. Pati Kupolo, I want reform and have control over Pinkin Kingdom. I want to be strongest king in this land. <laughs> All right, your majesty, I will execute your command. Then, war between Pinkin Kingdom and Krathenbaka happened. The result, Prabhu Boko was died in that war. Pati Kupolo ran away from the battle and report to Rara Jongram that her father was killed by a pinging knight named Bandung Bandawaso. Rara Jongram was very sad, but suddenly Bandung Bandawaso and his soldiers came to Krathenboko. Oh, beautiful lady, who are you? Uh, I am Rara Jungra, the daughter of Krathenboko. Is that you who killed my father? Uh, I'm so sorry, Rara Jungra. I, did, I didn't mean to. Uh, will you be my queen? If you want to marry me, you must build a thousand temples just in one night. Could you? Bandung Wonder Wars so expect the challenge. Then he calls the Ganyus army and the Ganyus army work it rapidly. Rara Jongrang's was very worried, but then she had a strategy. My my servants, please help me. This strategy could make the dark seem to be bright, and the sun was going to rise in the east. Oh look, the sun is coming. We have to go. Bandung Bandawasa was very upset because the temples had not finished. But then he knew that Rara Jongrang had tricked him. Rara Jongrang, I have put 9,029 temples and I just need one more temple. And one more temple. Is that you? Roro Jungrang turned into a state. That's all my story. Thank you. Uh.